Okay, so you just broke into Charlie. On here, you click which one you want to play. I've seen some actual gameplay of this side, so I'm gonna start on this side. Guess it's time to face the cupcakes. Valoria the Tender Tarkeen! Bella! Where is she? There you are! I was getting worried! Worried that I chickened out? No! I know you're not afraid of anything. I mean, what's to fear? This is a great honor. Right! Wait, I can't tell if you're being serious. Well, there is one part that I'm really afraid of. What's that? I'm afraid that you won't get any food because I'm gonna beat you to the Maiden's Feast. Dream on! Hello? Shh. Surprise! Whoa. Yay! There is my Valoria. Oh, look at my pretty girl. I can't believe. I just can't believe. We're very proud of you. I think that's what your mother is trying to say. Oh, she's not even dressed yet? Can we do that after cake? Come on, cake first! All right, but come on. Let's get this good time over with. Oh, yes, cake. Now, where did I put that knife? Nobody touches that cake until I find the ceremonial knife. All right. Looks like we gotta find that knife. Let's check over here. Maybe the knife is under this towel. <laughs> Never gonna find it. Dad, I hope you're not hiding that knife for your own good. <laughs> they got a rag. Oh, not there. Let's ask Grandpa. Grandpa Beastender? <laughs> Know where mom's knife is? <laughs> Wouldn't tell you if I did. I'm not doing one thing to help for this shame feast. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this maiden's feast either, to tell you the truth. Then fight it, girl. Stand up for yourself. I hope you're not filling that girl's head with nonsense, Brahma. <laughs> Why do you hate the Maiden's Feast, Grandpa? Because this used to be a town of warriors. It's a travesty, Bella. Why'd we stop being warriors? Lavina Clench and her ilk said there was too much bloodshed, pushed for appeasement. So we went soft, became a town of bakers. Hey, Gramps, want a cupcake? Um, yes. I'd better go find that knife. Don't you dare. I hid it for a reason. You did what? Oh, nothing. I must be losing my mind. All right, let's get a let's get a cupcake for Grandpa. Don't touch the red ones. Mom made those just for me. You're going to eat all of those? I've already had six. <laughs> that explains a lot. Oh. Okay. If there was a day to splurge, it's today. All right. So let's give this to him. For me? <laughs> no, I'm just showing it to you. For you. For you, Grandpa. Don't mind if I do. Oh my. Where would I? Hmm. Where could it be? I remember I had it, and then... Oh, 
Not until I find that knife, young lady. She already caught me using my fingers. <laughs> Eyes in the back of her head, that woman. Know where Mom's knife is, Rocky? If I did, we'd all be eating cake right now! Don't suppose you have another knife in the back we can use? I do, but your mom brought out a special one she wants to use. She wants everything to be perfect on your special day. Lavina? What is it, girl? My grandpa doesn't look too happy about this feast. Your grandpa is just stuck in the ways of old. Your grandma was the same way. Bless her soul. Not all of the town elders have stayed as hip and with it as I have. <laughs> Can I ask you about the Maiden's Feast? Weren't you paying attention in Maiden training? How many of these feasts have you organized? Let's see. A new Grand Mog appears every 14 years, and I'd have seen six of them, so... Hey! Are you trying to get my age out of me? I'll never tell. <laughs> What is Mog Chathra? The latest in a long, distinguished line of Grand Mogs to visit our land. Distinguished? Well, anything that lives that long becomes distinguished. I mean, look at me! <laughs> Where do creatures like Mog Chathra come from? They come from beyond the Plague Dam. I want to go beyond the Plague Dam someday. It's forbidden! But maybe you'll be lucky enough to be taken there soon in Mog Chathra's stomach. <laughs> How much do we know about these Grand Mogs? The Grand Mogs have visited our lands for as long as anyone can remember. They hide in the wilderness for years, and then they come to feed. After feeding, they return to their land and... It is imagined breed. You actually imagine that? Eh. <laughs> Why was I chosen? In every town visited by a Grand Mog, the villagers vote for the maidens who represent their town's best qualities. So in other words, beats me. Mog Chathra attacks other towns? Of course! Maryloft just had their Maiden's Feast yesterday. That's how we know he's coming here next. Uh, they're a pretty tough act to follow. Amazing feather work. Okay. <laughs> I think I know all I need to know about the Maiden's Feast. All you need to know is how to look pretty in your dress. We'll take care of the rest. So why don't we just fight Mog Chathra? Silence! Talk like that could ruin the Maiden's Feast. If you destroy the feast, Mog Chathra will destroy this village, including your family. Is that what you want? No. <laughs> Any idea where Mom's knife is? We're late. If I knew, I would have cut that cake, shoved it down your gullets, and had us out the door already. Oh! I'd better go look for that knife. And hurry. If we're late, you won't be selected, and your family will be shamed. Doesn't sound too bad not being selected. Hey, don't here. go get dressed yet. I don't want you getting cake on your good outfit. Oh, a little frosting never hurt a maiden's feast gown. Oh. This game is so cute. No, Let's talk to Mom. Mom? I was just wondering, what if we fought the monster instead of feeding it? That's my girl! Now that's beast ender blood talking. Please, my loves, don't make this any harder than it already is. <laughs> Where would I? I Check think that's that. supposed to look like Mog Chathra, my handsome date to the prom. <laughs> handsome date to the prom. I remember I had it. Handsome grand. I hope that dress isn't to scale. How would I walk in that thing? Let's see. Where oh, could the knife so be? Oh, wait. What can I do? With One that? of my mom's special dish towels, and it's still dry. What can I do with this? Can I give it to Grandpa. Handicap. Definitely some. Need a towel, Grandpa? Why? Do I look like some old drooling invalid to you? He 
he's already got a towel. It's just got to be. Need a towel? Do you see any frosting on my face? No. You're very neat. I know how to hide the evidence of cupcake stealing. <laughs> oh. I must be the only thing she wants is that knife. I'm tempted to snap her with it, but I don't want to embarrass my mom. <laughs> Let's see what other things we can use in there. So items glow when you want to no, no use way. it. So I don't want to mess up the frosting. Okay, let's see. What else can we use it on? Nope, not there. I could cover it up, but I'll have to face him sooner or later. Oh. Drying that won't help. Where would I? Put it back Hiding there. them won't do any good. Rocky's got the scent. No backing out now. Too many people would see me. Definitely someone. Hey, don't go get dressed yet. I don't want you getting cake on your good outfit. Oh, a little frosting never hurt a maiden's <laughs> feast gown. Well, I'm already stuck. Oh, okay. Where is that darn knife? Maybe somebody else. You sure this maiden's feast stuff. is a good idea, Pops? I. It's what you want, right? I guess so. I mean, you hear about it all your life. I'm just starting to wonder. Don't worry, sweetheart. You'll do great. Hmm. It's just got to be. Grandpa Beastender? Huh? Hey, Gramps, want a cupcake? Um, yes. I'd better go find that knife. <laughs> Why not? You eat the one you've got before you grab another. Mom, it's her special day. Let her have all the cupcakes she wants. Except the red ones. Uh, one of my them. mom's special dish towels, and it's still dry. It's still dry. That has no, to mean something. Not there. I don't want to mess it up. My dad worked hard on that. Where would I? He never samples his own wares. Hmm. I remember I had it. Hey, want a cupcake? No way! It's your special day! And the white ones are gross. <laughs> oh, frustrating. Cupcake? Oh, not now, honey. I have got to find that knife. Did I leave it in the kitchen? I'm so no. stuck right now. Oh my gosh. Maybe having a little food in your belly would help you relax, Lavina. Having you in that monster's belly is the only thing that's going to help me relax. Yikes. No use mincing words at this point, child. This stupid knife is ruining my daughter's special day. For me? No, Mom says you can't have any. I'm just showing it to you. Ah, I didn't want it anyway. Oh, I'm so mad. What do I it's do? just got to be. Can I use it on myself, maybe? Okay. Oh, no luck. I'm too nervous to eat. I don't need drying. I'm too nervous to even sweat. I must be losing my mind. Hmm. Hey, Mom Chathra, you hungry? Oh, that's right. You only eat maidens. Where the heck is the knife? No, oh, okay, no I can right click where? to open this up. Lavina? What is it, girl? So, why don't we just fight Mog Chathra? Silence! 
Talk like that could ruin the Maiden's Feast. If you destroy the feast, Mog Chathra will destroy this village, including your family. Is that what you want? No. I'd better go look for that knife. And hurry. If we're late, you won't be selected and your family will be shamed. Oh, oh my gosh. Where, where could it be? Did I leave it in the kitchen? No. Grandpa Beastender? <laughs> One of my mom's special dish towels, and it's still dry. Oh, where is that darn knife? I'm tempted to snap her with it, mm -hmm. but I don't want to embarrass my mom. Think, Morelia, think. I don't want to mess up the frosting. I hope that dress isn't to scale. How would I walk in that thing? I don't want to mess it up. My dad worked hard on that. Oh, no. Better not. Better not. Uh. I must be losing my mind. If there was a day to splurge, it's today. One of my mom's special dish towels, and it's still dry. You seem excited. I am. I think I'm gonna barf. That could be all the cupcakes you've been eating. I'm just sad I'm too young. I wish we didn't have to wait 14 years for another mog. I'll try to make you proud, Rocky. I'm already proud of you, stupid. Cupcakes. Oh my God. Cupcakes! Oh my god! Yay! Oh, so Need a towel? Do you see any frosting on my face? No. You're very neat. I know how to hide the evidence of cupcake stealing. What do I do? Okay, hold on. Definitely I'm gonna pause it. Out here. Okay. Oh, where this. is that darn knife? Wait, 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 wait. This stupid knife. Grandpa Beastender? <laughs> Grandpa Beastender? <laughs> hey, Gramps, want a cupcake? No, no, no. Yes. I'd better go find that knife. <laughs> For me? Split it with you? Deal. On second thought, you can have the whole thing. Suit yourself. Now, where did I put that thing? What thing? No, uh, nothing. Uh, I didn't say anything. All right, let's go knife my mom. All right, time to serve this girl up. But first, can I ask just one more time? Honey, why don't we just kill Mog Chathra? <laughs> here, here. <laughs> oh, honey. Oh, we're going to miss your sense of humor. So obviously she's Majestic being sacrificed. Majestic to behold. Oh, inspiring, powerful, mysterious. But Mog Chathra is more than that. Merciful and generous. Mog Chopra keeps our town safe. All he asks is may he pick some of our beautiful flowers as he passes through. Please come, Mog Chopra, and make your selections. Welcome to the Maiden's Feast. Show him what you're made of, Bella. I know he'll pick you. This can't be right. make myself the center of any vibe. Hey, does that costume have any thorns we can use as weapons? It does, but they're made out of chocolate. 
Regardless, I accept my noble burden, not with apprehension, but with joy. I give my life so that no harm comes to our village. No! I give my life! No, me! Sheesh. Center of mass, maybe. No more ugliness, girls. Hey, what do you say we break out of here? Trying to get us all to quit so you'll win the feast, huh? Well, it's not gonna work on me. I'm in it to win it, baby. You're making me hungry. I'm trying to make Mog Chathra hungry. These girls have it all backwards. Think it's attractive to starve themselves. Wanna trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Hmm. What do you got? Need a towel? Nope. They taught us to eat daintily in finishing school. I'm warning you, buzzard! I will fuck you alive if you come near my food again! How about the satisfaction of helping out a fellow maiden? Hmm. Sounds good, but not half as satisfying as this drumstick. Never mind. Just wanted to say good luck. Bye. No more ugliness, girls. Mom Chocolate responds to me too, but... It's hard to tell where the dress ends and the cake starts. Sorry, but beauty is nothing without a little heat. Hey, I've got a plan. I already have a plan, thanks. Attract Mog Chopra with my slender frame and be remembered forever as a hero. Well, good luck. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. When the monster gets close, you can use your candles to burn its eyes. Don't distract me. I think I've got a chance to win this. <laughs> Nothing left but crumbs. Now Horrible. Slop eater. He's coming for more. It's nice to be armed, but I wish this were more monster-sized. I'd never be able to cut through that thick hide. Even those eyes look armor-plated. If those are even eyes. I just want you to know that it's a great honor to be a... Uh... Shredding my mom's dish towel isn't going to help. Want to trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Hmm. What do you got? How about something bubbly to wash it down? Actually, I could use a swig of something. Okay, I'll see what I can get you. Just wanted to say good luck. Bye. But I think maybe we should. I mean, let's not be Hey, can I have a drink of that water? Trade you for that sweet corset you've got on. Never can be too thin. This horrible thing? You got a deal. Ooh, what a relief. I feel so much. Oh, I'm sorry. But this thing's just too big for me. Trade back. 
like to shred this thing, it might come in handy later. I've never heard of stuffing a corset. Probably because nobody does that. Shredding my mom's dish towel isn't going to help. I know they don't make two brushes your size, but really? Want to trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Hmm. What do you got? How about the slimming corset? Why would I want to hide my best assets from Mount Chandra? He'll be looking for a full-size meal after his long trip. Never mind. Just wanted to say good luck. Bye. Can I borrow that bottle one more time? Keep it. Thanks. I don't need it where I'm going. Wanna trade something for a bite of that drumstick? What do you got? Need a towel? Nope. They taught us to eat daintily in finishing school. I'm warning you, mother! I will fuck you alive if you come near my food again! How about something bubbly to wash it down? Well, thanks. Don't mind if I... Ah! Look at me! I'm soaked! Oh god. Okay. Quick! Quick! Help me put myself back together! Uh, a little help here? Wanna trade something for a bite of that drumstick? What do you got? I've got a towel here if you throw me that drumstick. You have a towel? Why didn't you say so? You've been standing there. Are you part vulture or something? How can you think about food at a time like this? Here, Birdie. Oh, come on. So close. I don't want to stab that bird. I still need her to get out of here. Oh, yeah. And also... I'd lose my knife. It's not long enough. Much as I'd like to shred this thing, it might come in handy later. That's it. Clap those big blue wings. Just a little bit harder. Come on, girl. Give it all you've got. It's nice to be armed, but I wish this were more monster size. It's hard to tell where the dress ends and the cake starts. Come on, girl. Give it all you've got. Nothing left to cut. Come on, girl. Give it all you've got. I don't want to stab that bird. I still need her to get out of here. where the dress ends and the cake starts. <laughs> Nothing left but crumbs. Horrible. Nothing left but crumbs. Horrible. Come on, girl. Give it all you've got. Don't come any closer. I'm armed. I'd never be able to cut through that thick hide. Even those eyes look armor plated. If those are even eyes. It's hard to tell where the dress ends and the cake starts. Hey, how about we split this cupcake? 
brought back a girl with me. Ooh, a new recruit. Time for your old man to become Mr. Smooth. 